Welcome back to another week of Fordham's Ram Roundup. My name is Krista Filangieri, and I'm here with Fordham Baseball's head coach, Kevin Leanne. Coach, the guys are coming off of having swept George Washington this past weekend. Joe Renko hit a walk-off single in the ninth to give you an 8-7 to seven win. How are the guys feeling? Well, you know, after that game, they're definitely energized. I mean, it was a lot of fun watching them uh, celebrate on the field um, in a big game, you know, a game that uh, really put us in a pretty good position. So, um, just really uh, excited for them and happy, um, you know, to see, you know, a lot of their hard work uh, pay off in, in that game. And uh, just a, a great feeling, and I know the guys are pumped. How important were those three wins? Yeah, I mean, those three for us, I mean, uh, Puts us at 12 and six, a good spot. Um, yeah, I think for for us, it just gives you a little br uh, breathing room. Um, uh, it's tough sometimes when you look at the uh, weekends and you look at them and you say we gotta win two or we gotta you know, gotta get a win in, in this weekend. Um, it's a little bit more pressure, um, a little bit harder on the guys. Um, so I, it just gives you a little breathing room. So. Like you just said, headed into this weekend, you're 12 and six. You're going down to face St. Joe's, who is currently 11 and seven. What is the mindset? You know, it, now it's the focus is, is um, you know, win games and, and try to improve where we're where we're at. I mean, I think um, you know the top seeds are within reach. Uh, it'd be um, it'd be really nice uh, for us to be a, a one or a two seed uh, here at Fordham hosting the tournament, but. Um, it's, it's still a lot of work to do. Um, we were in the same position last year, and we really had to fight and claw to get in. Um, but we're really focused on um, you know, one game at a time and um, and just trying to uh, improve on where we're at. So, One game at a time going into Friday. What are you really depending on to put you over at St. Joe's? Yeah, we got to pitch. Um, we got to pitch um, the way we're capable. Uh, um, I thought we threw really well uh, this weekend against George Washington. Um, so if we can pitch, uh, I think we've got a chance against them. Um, you know, so it's just that's been the key to our season is, is getting a good effort on the mound. And um, you know, I think we're going to score your typical five, six runs. Um, but uh, our pitching is going to be the, the difference. Our pitching and defense has been great um, in a lot of our games. So. I think that's the difference for us. If we can do that, we should have a chance. So. Speaking of your pitching, what has senior Joe Sarapika contributed to the team this year? Joe's been huge. You know, he, we weren't 100% uh, sure what role he was going to fill for us, uh, whether it's starter or or uh, bullpen. Um, you know, we had a uh, uh, injury where Joe um, had to go back in uh, and as a starter. He started out as a starter, went into the bullpen because they thought it would help help us as a team. And then we threw him back on the, um, as a starter. I mean, he's been uh, as good as you can be in conference games um, throughout the year. He's given us a chance uh, pretty much every time he's taken the mound. Um, you know, so we're just uh, you know fortunate. He's had such a great year, and we're hoping he can continue this weekend. Another pitcher who has really made a difference was your freshman, Rice Knarr, who was just named the A-10 Rookie of the Week. How is that looking forward to the next year? Is that Fordham? Yeah, Reese uh, is an exciting pitcher. It's frustrating. We didn't get him um, as much time as we would have liked early in the year because his arm was a little sore. But, um, you know, watching him pitch, it's, you can see, uh, you know, definitely the upside for him. Uh, you know, so he just has to stay uh, uh, focused on what he's doing and, and, uh, and keep working hard. And I think he's, he's got a bright future for us in the program. But, um, He's, got a, he's definitely a big part of our success right now. So. Thank you, Kevin. Good luck this weekend. Thank you. I am back here with senior Joe Sarapika. Joe, you're supposed to be pitching this weekend on Saturday. How are you feeling headed in? Uh, I feel good. Uh, lately, I've been pitching really well, and uh, we've been winning series, so that's the main thing. But uh, I'm just going to continue to execute pitches and you know, just keep my team in the game. How do you work on executing those pitches? Uh, well, it's all in the middle of the week type stuff, uh, flat grounds, bullpens, whatever, whatever we're told to do. Sometimes you got to take initiative on yourself as well. I'm just working hard Wednesdays and Thursdays, all those days in between the starts. How do you think playing the past three years at Fordham has helped you um, get ready for your senior year? Uh, well, it's definitely been a mental check. I mean, I, I've had two surgeries 
one baseball related, one not. So that's definitely helped me, especially last year was a down year for me. It's definitely a mental reality check, which and mentality is all baseball. It doesn't matter how physically gifted you are, if you don't believe in yourself, you're not going to succeed. Can you tell me a little more about that baseball mentality? Oh uh, yeah. Um, well, when you're on the mound, you have to act like you're the best person on the field. That's what I try to act like. It's try to think, try, that's what I try to think about. If um, it's all about confidence, I mean, if it's 0-2 and I'm going to throw a fastball, I'm going to try to throw as hard as I can and get it right by him. So it's all confidence. If you don't believe in yourself, you don't have that intent, you're not going to succeed. How is having the A-10 tournament here this year? I know you guys have been saying 528 throughout the season. How's that mindset? Uh, well, it's definitely something that brings you together as a team. Uh, we want that, that one unified goal. And uh, without that, like I said, it's no cohesion. Without cohesion, you're just not going not gonna to succeed. How have you viewed the competition so far this season? Uh, well, it's definitely been wild in our conference. Every team is either a game or two out of first place. I know we're just a game and we're in third place. So uh, every game is important. Like Coach said, if we win the first two, we have to win the third one. We're treated like it's the first one. If we lose the first two, then it's a you know, type of do or die situation. This past weekend, you guys won all three games against George Washington. How was that? It's huge, considering the week before we lost two out of three to UMass. You know, it isn't really the strongest team in conference, so it was a down weekend for us that weekend, so we needed to make up a few games, which we did. Good luck this weekend. That would do it for this week's Ram Roundup. Thank you to head coach Kevin Layton and senior Joe Sarapika. The Rams will travel down to Philadelphia this weekend to face off against St. Joe's. You can catch all three games on the A10 network. Be sure to follow the Rams on Twitter at Fordham Baseball and check out FordhamSports.com. I'm Krista Phil and Jerry for WFUV Sports.